Young Girl Leisurely Reading by Liu Ziodong 1993 presents an intimate glimpse into a moment of quietude, capturing the essence of youth and contemplation through the lens of the early 21st century. Liu Ziodong, a Chinese artist, is known for his realist paintings that often depict ordinary people and scenes from everyday life. His work bridges the personal and the universal, offering a window into the lived experiences of his subjects. In Young Girl Leisurely Reading, we are immediately drawn to the figure of a young girl, absorbed in her book. The painting invites us to ponder what world has she been transported to through the pages she peruses? Is it a world of fantasy, a historical epic, or perhaps a tale mirroring her own life? Set against a nondescript backdrop, the girl's gaze is directed upwards, perhaps lost in thought or imagination sparked by her reading. This upward gaze might symbolize hope, dreams, or the quest for knowledge. Zayadong's choice of a simple environment focuses our attention on the girl, making her the nexus of the narrative the painting conveys. The composition, with the girl centrally placed, leads the viewer's eye directly to her face and then to the open book, creating a triangle that forms the heart of the painting. The use of space is intimate, with the girl and her chair occupying the majority of the frame inviting us into her personal space, her moment of leisure. The balance of the composition is carefully maintained, with the girl's presence commanding the space without overwhelming it. Ziodong's color palette is muted, relying on earthy tones that give a sense of warmth and calm. The white of the girl's blouse and the blue of her collar and ribbon provide a subtle contrast drawing attention to her without the use of vibrant colors. This choice of color not only tells us about the aesthetic preferences of the era, but also speaks of the tranquility and simplicity of the scene. The brushwork is both detailed and relaxed. The textures of the girl's clothing and the chair are rendered with a delicate touch, while the background and her skin tones are treated with broader, smoother strokes. This technique mirrors the dual nature of reading as an activity. It is at once a gentle, leisurely pastime and one that requires active engagement and imagination. In terms of light and shadow, the painting appears to be bathed in a soft, diffused light, highlighting the girl's face and hands and casting gentle shadows that give depth to the folds of her clothing and the contours of her form. There is a harmony here, a balance between light and shadow that echoes the tranquility of the scene. The subject matter is straightforward a girl and her book, yet it speaks volumes about the universal joy of reading and the inner lives of young individuals. We are left to wonder about the content of the book and how it reflects or contrasts with the girl's own story. As for symbolism, the book is a powerful symbol of knowledge, escape, and the shaping of young minds. There is a timelessness to the scene, despite its contemporary setting. One might also consider the act of reading as a form of resistance in an age dominated by digital media, making this a quietly rebellious image. The historical and cultural context of this painting is important created just years after the tumultuous events of Tiananmen Square in 1989, young girl leisurely reading could be seen as an assertion of peace and normalcy in a rapidly changing China, a reminder of the personal, quiet moments that continue regardless of the larger societal shifts. The emotional impact of the painting is subtle yet profound. It exudes a sense of peace and introspection inviting the viewer to reflect on their own moments of stillness and personal growth. As for originality, Liu Ziodong's work stands apart for its candid and unglamorized portrayal of everyday life. His style diverges from both the propagandistic art that was prevalent in China for many decades and the more experimental approaches of contemporary Western art striking a path that is both realist and deeply humanist.
Regarding the artist's intent, Xiaorong often aims to document the world around him, imbuing his subjects with dignity and depth. This painting likely continues that tradition, focusing on the inner life of a young girl as something worthy of artistic exploration. The provenance of this work is not widely known, but the value of such a piece lies in its cultural significance and the insight it provides into the era and the artist's oeuvre. In closing, Young Girl Leisurely Reading by Liu Xiaorong is a testament to the enduring power of art to capture the quiet, profound moments of human experience. It's a painting that invites reflection and connection, reminding us of the simple pleasures that bind us across cultures and generations. If you've been moved by this exploration, please like, subscribe, and comment with your thoughts. And if you have the opportunity, seek out this painting to experience its serene beauty in person, and feedback in the comments section with your experiences and thoughts. Thank you for watching, and I look forward to welcoming you back for more art historical adventures.